so we, we picked some coffee beans um, and we, uh, we soaked them overnight. We have some that we've already processed and these ones right here are what's left. So we've got the coffee beans here. Put it lower in the sun. So, so, so these coffee beans right here are have been soaking for about 24 hours and now we have to um, husk them. We have to take off the, the cherry part. And um, what's that called? It's called husking? I don't remember. Okay, so we get to husk these and then we get to dry them. So the first part of this is over. So we got these guys right here and we're good to go. And these were just the cherries that we picked and then we just soaked them in water overnight right, for 24 hours. Okay. Oh, we dropped one. I better get it back. Can't waste any precious coffee. Okay. That's it. You don't want to talk about this stuff? No, not yet. I'm going to wait till we get yours until I get you doing the coffee. Nice bananas. Okay. You have no rights. This is not a democracy. Okay, so. Um, so what are you doing there? I don't know. Separating coffee cherries from the beans. Okay, so what do we have over here? Those are the coffee cherries that we picked yesterday and soaked overnight. And so that makes it easy to remove the cherry from the beans. And you have to love coffee to do this. That looks fun. Why don't you join me? Okay, so do a couple of like good like that. So oh, I can't tell anything. That's how they're gonna come out. So you soak these overnight. Yeah, they were bright red when we started. Now they're kind of rotten looking. But and I kind of like this bright red. I don't know why this one didn't turn. But at the cherry, it's hard to separate that way. So if you soak them overnight, they're kind of degrade and it's easy to separate the cherry out. I mean the bean out of the cherry. Okay, so now that we've done this, and then we put them in a bowl. Mm -hmm. And then we do a light rinse and then we dry them. We dry them on the screen for a week at least. What do we do? Can you say it again? Dry them on a screen for a week at least. Turning mm -hmm. them over every day. Just a week? We just can dry them for a week? I'm not sure exactly. I said at least. At least a week? Yeah. Okay. Well, thank you for telling me. You're welcome. You're very close with that camera. Yeah. Okay, fine. But that's going to be good. Okay, so we got some now out here drying. I'm on the screen. And these are drying for actually a day already. So these are a little bit drier. These here we just did earlier today. So they're still a little bit wet. And we're going to leave these out here for at least a week or maybe two. And dry them in the sun. And um, then it's on to step two or three or wherever we're at. Okay.